Okay guys, now I'm gonna show you how to um, how to turn this machine. Actually, I'm turning in the machine. I'm not turning the actual machine, I'm turning in the machine because it can rotate 360 on an excavator. But I actually wanna turn my tracks. So to do that, you gotta go in the opposite direction. So one track is going backwards and one is going forward. I can do it by hand, I can do it by hand, or I can do it by foot. My left uh, foot is pushing forward and my right is pulling backwards. Now I, I actually just turn the entire machine. I, now I straight the machine up with my tracks and now you can't see the tracks in the camera. So to the side. Okay? so. This machine goes backwards and forwards. Sometimes if you're turned the other way, this way would be going backwards. But right now, this way is going forward. So, let's dig some dirt. I'm gonna swing this way. Grab some dirt. Oh, you guys are a little bit bent, okay. Shake it so no extra falls and bring it in towards me. Swing around so I don't hit that pile of asphalt. And I'm gonna throw it over here. And let's go again. Bring it in towards me and swing around so I don't hit the asphalt. Always remember when operating excavators, overhead wire and ups obstacle is number one prior is your number one priority, okay? So I wanna close this in by pulling into me. Actually it's not enough. Push down, pull in, and close the bucket enough take it up maybe a little bit more into me and swing around swing around extend to where I want to dump it once it's there open my bucket shake it out curve it back in bring it into me simultaneously into me into me and try to turn all all together okay so the more experienced machine operator kind of do everything together so if you're watching from outside you actually think the machine is doing everything by itself that's when you become a smooth operator okay right now uh, we're learning to get better all right so right now I'm practicing to get a little bit better and you are probably watching so the next time or if you have the opportunity to go in if you're permitted remember major disclosure you can't just jump into a machine and operate there's uh, laws regulation actually you have to fill out a circle check so it's kind of same like a forklift if you're operating a forklift you must be licensed to or trained certified and or be supervised I am actually being supervised right now and um well i was supervised earlier and now uh the more experienced operators say it's okay then you do it okay so this remember this is not a training video this is just uh, a video to show to if you're it's just for who is curious okay because this is not a training video it's only if you're curious to operate a machine i'm showing you how to operate that's all